you just have to focus on the chapters that you are most comfortable with. To get into an IIT, the minimum percentage required is just 30 to 40 percentage. There's a few things that you should know about JE Advance and how to prepare for it. Another difference between JE Mains and JE Advance is that in JE Mains, Hello, my name is Mayin Salaudi and I am a student of Race Public School. I mainly prepare for JE Mains and Advanced. I wrote the first session JE Mains and I got 99.59 percentile as a result. Now I am preparing for JE Advanced. There are a few things that you should know about JE Advanced and how to prepare for it before writing the exam on June 4th this year. JE Advanced is all about IQ and uh, how much you know about every concept that we have learned in physics, chemistry and maths. Another difference between JE mains and JE advance is that in JE mains, just by leaving one subject entirely, you will still be able to get a really good person there. However, in JE advanced, we need to score a minimum score in three subjects in order to get into the rank list. And you need to score a lot more to get into the actual rank list. For JE Advanced, you don't have to study every single chapter of a subject. You just need to develop expertise in several chapters and write everything that you know without any carelessness so that you can at least get a, a, a decent score to get yourself into any kind of IIT. So for chemistry, you can study as much as you can as it is one of the most highest scoring subjects for the examination. But however, for physics and uh, maths, you, are, you don't have to focus on every single chapter. You can focus on uh, at least a few important chapters to get a really good score. For example, in, for, in physics, uh, in various important chapters includes mechanics, then uh, electrostatics, then current, current electricity, then uh, optics, and modern, uh, modern physics. For maths, the important chapters are permutations and probability, and as well as integration, integration and um, differentiation, differential calculus, and also uh, matrices and determinants. Then there is trigonometry, and as well as a few other subjects. But you don't have to study all of these. Again, I'm, that's what I'm telling you. You just have to focus on the chapters that you are most comfortable with. And also that those chapters should be have a good weightage in JE Advanced. To get into an IIT, the minimum percentage required is just 30 to 40 percentage. And you get even lower if you are one of the backward classes like ST, SC or OBC. To all those who are preparing for JE Advanced, including myself, good luck.